Lady Zedal, Fight Connect TV, standing backstage after a very successful premier fight night number two with promoter of the night and professional Muay Thai fighter, Dylan Marr. Hey, Lydia. How are you doing? Good. Cool. You swear I was in a fight with all the sweat <laughs> running <laughs> off my head. Fucking hell, I've been running around all night and I had the junior, junior show this morning as well. Yeah. That ran from about, uh, I was like 10 to about half 12, so it run off my feet there and a couple of hours of a break then. Main show. Got a few bit of sparring and I saw yeah, your Yeah, 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 we got a, bit, uh, a few rounds of sparring and pads in. Dean, Dean James actually held the pads for me, which is great. I just called him Brian so nice in my interview. Oh, I was like, Brian? I was like, then I was like, fuck, did yeah, you yeah, actually yeah, call yeah, Dean yeah. James Brian? Like, that. Hey, look, oh. it's late, it's late, it's about 12 it's o'clock. It's 12 o'clock. The show's I'm been going on since 6, so can't hours, say much. Yeah, 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 so yeah. Fun. But no, it was a great night. Oh, no, I'm delighted Come with on. the way it went. Like last year, I was saying to everyone, we sold about maybe 300 in total. This year, we just 300 sold before the show even started. We had about another 120 in at the door. Like, so it was, it was a great night. Yeah. Um, hard night for our own fighters. We uh, only had, actually, didn't, I didn't have any win. We had a demo at the start. Bonnie, she got on great now, in fairness. Yeah, she did, she to be honest, I, it was a demo because we were kind of like, she's still a bit novice, but uh, she's only had one demo before that. And like, tonight was like 10 times what she did in the first fights. So we're delighted with her. Yeah. Everyone else, they just kind of had a tough night at the office. But look, it's a good experience for them fighting on their home show. None of them had easy fights either. Um, I didn't want to give them easy fights, do you know what I mean? I wanted What's to point that? Exactly, I wanted to give them all a challenge. Like, yeah. and they all stepped up to it, you know. Eric just fell short, I think. He was he was had a, he had a great performance. I think he, if he just relaxed a bit more, and uh, he just fell into the game of like magic, he's just forward, just clinch, clinch. And every time he was Eric would go for the hands or the elbow, he'd fall into the clinch. But um, no, look, lo lots of lessons to be learned, you know. Do you know what, Dylan, especially about Eric, you know, the one thing that's so admirable about him is that he kind of just came on the scene as in, yeah. like, to everyone's awareness, like, oh, this yeah. new guy, and he was taking the challenges, and he was getting in there. Like, Magic has been doing this a while. He's much oh, more man. experienced Eric's than him. Do you know what I mean? Tonight, you know, it was Eric's first A class, and a funny story. It was meant to be A class with um, elbow pads, but uh, I had a guy bring him my elbow pads, and he brought one pair. So like, at like half eight, we were, like, we were kind of like, right, boys, it's either one each or it's fucking full A class. And the yeah. two boys were like, let's just go with the elbows, you know. Right. So yeah. it was good for Eric to get the experience. The two, two of them were left with a couple of stitches, so they yeah. both got each other there. You know oh, what I mean? That's what you want, though, exactly. isn't it? Yeah, I yeah, it was a bar, but it was a great fight, and like I think the crowd was at its peak for that as well. So that South was a West. savage one, you yeah, know. And then Ian, just unlucky in the main event as well. Like we were saying just before we turn on the camera, the leg kicks from that man, that just like, are sick. Just like, I was I, like, was that a plan? Oh, Oh my, about a minute and a half into the fight, Ian like turned this way and I looked at his leg, I was like, hardly. And in my head, like you I was like, was that there before? We were the next fight? to each other. And I, I was like, like what the it? like he, oh man, he kicks like a mule, like yeah, but really again, good challenge for Ian. And to be honest, he fought out of his style. Ian is a real like hands heavy brawler. Mm -hmm. Do you know that's where he gets on well? But he stood with Josias and he landed a few nice scores and look the leg, he Josias just kept hammering that leg home all night long and he, knew, he could see when he was checking it and then yeah. when he was fading. Yeah, next thing he started you know changing I mean? to the southpaw. We told him to change, try and get the hands off, move move to the right, but Look, he just he had the leg hurt already. It was only a matter of time before he, he do you know what I mean? He got the better of him, like. But Absolutely. look, oh no, it was a good show. And I'm happy with the turnout. Thanks for everyone that came, yeah. all the fighters to like yourself, um, all, all the, the the media, everyone else that helped with the show. Um, like I I suppose I put it together, but it was not even close to being a one man show. There were so many people involved with helping. So thanks, big thanks to everybody. Absolutely. Well, thank yeah. you very much for having no us come along and booking us. Like honestly, no I really do appreciate it. So happy. thank you, because yeah, yeah, without really you booking us. There is no, exactly, there's nothing for the exactly. fires. We all have to no, work exactly. together. Do you know what I mean? Exposure is great for them. Like, do you know what I mean? So you're doing a great job. Thank you very much, well Dylan. Done, and thank stuff. you. And we see you Well, I was just about to say, Jesus, you're doing my job for me. You're answering all the questions. And I post questions. my interview with me, a winner, on your cow two weeks later. I'll get those yeah. wins back for us, boys. Don't worry. <laughs> tell you, it's going to be a good one. Well, listen, and I tell you, what, what was I going to say? That, oh, first thing, the hotel was brilliant. They were really supportive. Brilliant. They were fantastic. They were retweeting all them, like. the videos all yes, night and stuff like that. So they were really good. Fair play to you guys here. It was brilliant. Thanks to Hotel as well because you're fantastic guys to work with. Brilliant. Great venue. Everyone loves it so yeah fantastic could not be better could not be better you, oh let me say your cow two weeks time can't you're wait can't, <laughs> can't fucking wait can't fucking wait this man is fresh oh my god I'm two ready to go now can't wait this will be like for everyone right it's gonna be amazing like yeah, yeah, your cow was such a big show like you know and we've got like the main event Cut Craig and Singdam alone like and then you've got the uh, Harrison and the Italian dude uh, Chris, you know I mean? Christian yeah, Fasino Christian Fasino you've got Spencer Stefan like my, like I'm, I'm, Aaron Brown Jack McGuire Aaron Brown Jack you. McGuire you can name out Daryl and Gareth Yes. Dami, Niall, like it's These a huge card. These are all fights card. that could headline cards huge over card. here, do you know Huge I mean? card, yeah, so I'm delighted. I'm actually delighted to be one of the only fights on it that's an international fight to kind of get a chance to get my, do you know what I mean, get a bit yeah. more exposure out there because... Dan Bonner's a good fighter as well, great right? Great fighter, great fighter. He's strong and I, 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 I've seen him fight once or twice. Um, quite slow and strong, he kind of picks up the pace as he goes along. But like, that'll suit me better. Like It's just yeah. going to turn into one of those war of attrition's like we're pushing each other back, but I, I, I feel... 
hundred. I feel a hundred percent for this. And I feel and it's your time as well. Do you know? I feel it, I feel it's you're kind of peaking now, and it, you deserve a big stage, definitely, right? Definitely. Yeah, yeah. I had a hard loss in the last one, actually against Dean. Dean James is fighting Rob. Um, in the rematch we had, like you know, so I felt a bit. At the time, felt a bit hard done by a bit of decision, but after looking back on it and kind of thinking about how I trained for the fight, I know I could have done better on myself. Um, no matter what it looked like from the outside, you know, I know in my in my own head I could have done better. So I think I'm I'm definitely going to write that wrong now on on, on the 27. Like I'm I'm feeling great for this. I'm going to put on a good performance, performance of a lifetime. That's what I like for now, say. anyway. For now, <laughs> <laughs> I'm still young. <laughs> well, listen, thank you very much Thanks again for, for tonight, you, yes, and brilliant. I look forward to seeing you in two weeks. Can't wait. Yep. Dilamar for Fight Connect TV. Yep. Oh. <laughs>